Oh no, the water levels as well. Oh, it's good. Whoa, how many of them? Look at that. Hello guys and welcome to Dig or Die. Adventure game that you are starting as a person who crashed on this alien planet and your main goal is basically to build up your base, survive and hopefully eventually with time build a rocket and leave the planet. It reminds me a little bit of Terraria and a mix of Starbound as well. But it I think is unique enough to warrant playing it and is in early access, it's very very cheap. I got it for £1.99 which is basically pretty much nothing and is so worth it even at this stage of the game. So what I'm doing now, I'm kind of moving around in here, I have to find, obviously all the creatures are trying to kill you because that's how the alien planets are. And at night time, they will actually go and actively seek for you. So we have to be prepared for that. So our main goal now is to kill a few of these flying creatures, them like a fireflies and stuff. And they will give you here this blue gems. Hold on, let me just kill the dog and I'll show you. The blue gems in here. Blue energy gems. We need minimum of five. Because at the moment I have I can collect resources with my miniaturizer, but I cannot collect all of them yet. So I need to upgrade my miniaturizer and for that I will need five of these gems. So yeah, we need the gems. Not very good at shooting here. Okay, reload the weapon. And that's the mountain in here. I don't want to go that far really. In the mountain there is different biomes in here. And mountain bio at the moment we are completely not ready for it yet. Ah, he survived. The good thing is your HP points kind of recover. So it's not too bad, even if you take some damage you can you can generally survive it quite nicely. We can collect some trees because some of the wood will be useful for other things to build in here. So yes, let's collect them. Not too many, but really what 40 will do as nicely with everything else. And as the game progresses I will probably cut out most of the mining really because you know you want me you want to see me doing anything boring like that. But for now I will just show you what it is all about. Okay, there is a dog there, let's kill him. And the game features the water levels as well. As you can see as it drains, the water level increase in here. And the creatures, the water creatures can move from one location to the other. Like this fish could probably swim over there as well. And obviously the water as it should flows to the lowest possible point on the map. In that case in here. So what I'm going to do quickly in here, place my auto builder, build some of them, that will do, collect it and just build some of the platform in here. Platforms are helpful to basically climb everywhere as you can see and we'll be using quite a few of them in the game. Uh, come on, I need some of these flies, I'm really need not having too much luck with them, I need more of them, it's already halfway through the day and we haven't done that well. Okay, one more crystal, that's great, I need probably two more at least. Perfect. Come on. There is some more flying there. Awesome. And let's reload. Okay, let's just build some sort of platform here so I can walk easier without falling into the ground because if I fall there I don't have lights yet so I don't want to go into anything like that. Okay, there's dogs. Awesome. Dogs will drop them horns as well, you can use them for medicine later on in the game. And there are red flies, I don't want to mess with them so that's a different biome there as well. With the red, f red flies, basically they are upgraded enemies of these little white flies that we've been fighting a second ago. So I'm going to go from one direction to the other. I need some more. And we have to start building the base because at night time they will come for us. 
Come on, flies, drop me something. Okay, one more. Perfect. Awesome, okay, I have four. I need one more at least. Possibly more. Come on. Come on, come, come in here, come in here. Give me some luck. Nothing. Ah. Awesome, okay, we have five. That will help us a lot. Possibly I could do with one more just to get the better weapons, but with five I should be happy with what I have. I could build a better rep replicator or just more defenses and two reds. So we'll see, I will decide on it as we go in here. Oh, there is some flies there, in here, hidden. Fortunately, it didn't drop anything. Okay, what about you, mate? Awesome. With that, I think I should be quite okay now for defenses. So we have to go quickly, because it's nearly night time, and it's not going to be much fun in here. So what I'm going to do... I'm going to quickly jump around in here, kill this fly. Awesome, and now let's find some sort of location to go. Uh, I think we'll just dig in here. Dig it like that. And one more like that. And then we'll have defenses in here, perfect. Always nice to have a lower ground in here, so the water doesn't come to you. So we'll do it like that. With that now, I can start digging my base down. Can't see that much in here because obviously it's dark and you can't see too much. But I think that should, that should do us perfectly well. Okay, so I'm going to dig it out in here and kind of basically build up some sort of defenses just for this night. So we can survive here nicely. As you can see, the dogs can actually chew through the ground, so they can they can come to you, and they can cause problems. So we'll help him a little bit there, because I would rather fight him on my conditions than theirs. Okay, perfect. Let's put the replicator down. We'll use it to build quite a few of them two reds. I was collecting the scrap metal, and I have few two reds. Uh, let's just kill him. Ah, okay, because they will be coming very shortly here for us, so a few of them to reds have five, so we'll place some defenses, one, two, three in here, possibly one here, and one more in here. These defenses should keep us reasonably okay, but just to be safer, Let's just build more. This roof in here will help us a lot. Will keep me secured from my enemies. Won't be seeing them coming, but that should help me and that should help me as well in here. They will start shooting at my enemies as they come. Yeah, let's switch to weapons and you will see as it comes night time they will all start attacking me. The dogs will try to climb. If it rains, it will make it easier for them, so I hope it's not going to rain overnight. Casey Nali shoot in here, so I can just show you what is around us. As you can see in here. At the moment nothing comes, but they will they will come. You see that all the dogs are coming, they will not necessarily jump round. But yeah, my two reds will fight. They, they won't attack two reds directly. They will try to dig out though to me. So hopefully them two reds will protect me enough from all the dangers at night time. As you can see, it's getting quite dangerous. And it's raining, so the dogs will be able to climb easier. And I think they will get through. They are getting through. Hopefully my two reds will be able to stop them. I'm hoping so. But... Oh no, the water levels as well. But it's good. Whoa! How many of them? Look at that. I didn't expect them to come like that. They've jumped on me out of nowhere. Okay. 
Come on, come on, come on. All we have to do is survive a little bit longer. And the game will autosave eventually for us. Come on. It's getting dangerous. Whoa, dangerous. Low on resources. Dogs are attacking there. They're trying to dig for every possible ground on me. Uh, I need to reload. Come on. Perfect. Uh, they are digging through. They will get they will get in eventually. And that may cause problems for us. Come on. We need to reload again. The Tourettes. Come on, the Tourettes needs to help us. Uh, if they get through, that will cause a lot of problems. I don't want to fall in the ground. That would be a disaster for me. And I think I've sold yes, how to save. The night is finished, we are safe. We survived the night. All we have to do is just kill the rem remaining enemies and we should be fine. Come on, I will let them in. I will let them in just to lure them here. And we should be fine. Perfect. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Okay, perfect. We survived the night, guys. So, all we have to do now is collect all of that. All of them resources can be collected back. I can collect my two reds and we can try to expand and do other things. But that's going to be in the next episode, guys. So, for now, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode a lot. Let me know in the comments what you think about the game. And please, as well, follow me on Twitter because... That's where I'm the most active and that's where you can talk to me and see what it is all about on my, on my channel. So for now, thank you guys for watching and I will see you guys next time.